Hey Zoo family, welcome to today's video. Today's video is sponsored by Okai, and specifically the Okai Beetle, a brand new electric scooter hitting the market that we believe you will love because we love it. We didn't know we were scooter people until we rode the Beetle. This thing is a blast to drive, and we want to tell you a little bit about it. This scooter has so many features. There's three ways to start it, with your key, touchless with the key fob, or you can even unlock it through the Okai app. The app also has a lot of great features like diagnostics and battery management. With just the turn of a key, you can access the Beetle's swappable battery. And the entire battery is just 4.5 pounds, about the weight of two laptops. So if you want to have a backup battery, you can get even further. There's three drive modes for the Beetle. We mainly keep ours in the H mode. And so far, it tops out around 15 miles per hour, which feels great. It's the ideal speed for scootering. There's also L mode, which will help manage battery usage and tops out at nine miles per hour. And lastly, there's E mode. Tops out at three miles per hour, turns the light on, and extends battery life as long as possible. This scooter has amazing brakes. It can stop on a dime. As you can see from the footage, this is a high quality made scooter. It has fantastic shock absorption. As you can see from this chest cam footage, it manages all the little bumps in the sidewalk great. And when you're on a smooth surface, you'll feel like you're on a cloud. And just in case you were thinking this is a daytime only thing, think again. We love riding the Beetle at night. The temperatures are dropping here where we live and a nighttime ride is a blast on the Beetle. As you can see from the footage, it has a great headlight that'll keep the road in front of you lit. You'll love this thing any time of day. And when you're done, it folds up nice and easy. Thank you to Okai for sponsoring today's video and for this amazing product. We're already looking at buying a second one so Melanie and I can hit the road together. We hope you'll check out Okai's website and the new Okai Beetle launching soon. Hey Zoo family, welcome to today's video. I promise Daisy didn't just wake up even though she looks like it. She's just um, a little cranky, a little cranky because everyone's out here riding scooters and riding bicycles together. I'll show you what I mean. What's, what noise is your bicycle making? Huh. It's making a weird noise and mom's on the beetle, enjoying it. Oh yeah, look at you. The, the zoo family didn't know this. Show them how you ride without training wheels. Yes, sir. Look at that boy go. He learned to do that by himself, Zoo family. I was blown away. One of his training wheels fell off and he just pulled the other one off and decided, you know what, I'm not putting him back on. And he went out there and he taught himself how to ride a bike. <laughs> That's Timmy. That's Timmy for you. It's yeah. pretty amazing. How does it feel to be a big bike rider? Uh, kind of bumpy, kind of. Kind of crazy? But you look great doing it, man. How are you enjoying it? I don't even have to ask. I don't even have to ask. <laughs> she goes away again. Now, I hate to tell you, but we have to get... Oh, okay. I was going to say we have to get to work. <laughs> nice, Mom. Go. Go, I know. Now, what we really need to do today is organize our garage. You can see that's happening back there a little bit already. Um, we'll tell you what's going on with that. You got... No work. <laughs> you, we gotta work. <laughs> Come back. I'm not doing it alone, I'll tell you that much. We're gonna have to figure out a way to get her off the scooter. Come on. <laughs> mommy just keeps going round and round, doesn't she? When's mommy gonna get off and hold you? That's what we'll do. We'll use you to get her off the bike. Daisy says she wants you to come hug her. No, no tricks. No, tr no tricks. Lulu wants you to hug her. Sounds like a trick from Daddy. Lulu Thank wants you, you to hug her. Daddy. Wants you to hug her. She just wanted a hug. Psych! <laughs> <laughs>
We love the beetle. The garage needs to get cleaned. Ow. Oh. I'm just kidding. It's I overcast like it. and hot. I like it too. I should have a helmet on, by the way. I'm aware I should have a helmet on. It was mostly a joke. So now we gotta go organize the garage. And here's why we're doing that. As you know, I'm a pastor. As many of you know, anyways, I'm a pastor. And we um, get to help lead a church plant. If you're not familiar with what a church plant is, a church plant is a newer church, and ours happens to be a satellite campus of a mother church. So it's not like we're alone or a new church. We already have the same DNA as our mother church, and um, and therefore we we look and sound and operate a lot like the mother church. But we still operate like a brand new church, which is smaller and it means that you don't have a building of your own. And because you don't have a building of your own, it means you don't have storage space of your own. And it comes with the territory of church planting that if there's a bunch of stuff you don't have a place to store, guess where it goes, Zoo family? It goes right in there, the garage of the pastor. So now we gotta clean that garage out because, Mom, you wanna tell them the news? We got a storage unit! We got a storage unit! <laughs> Daisy didn't look impressed, but Mom and I are so psyched. We've had, oh my goodness, so much stuff in our garage from the church that we're happy to hold on to, but it means we can't even really store our own trailer in our garage anymore, and our HOA does not like that. We need to get the trailer back in the garage. And and because now we have this storage unit that the church is paying for, and um, it means that all it means that all the staff, not just me, other staff that had stuff in their garage, we can all bring all that stuff to the storage unit and have our have our little spaces in our garage back, and we will be able to put our trailer back in our garage, and we'll be able to have a clean garage. Frankly, it was really hard to even have a clean garage, an organized garage, with how much stuff was in the garage. Look at that kid. Look at Timmy go. That is so impressive. Man, look at that kid. Uh, so proud of him. Okay, everybody ready to go organize? No! Here we go! And just like that, we're over here. There's the new storage unit. It's not even filled with stuff, and we're about to fill it. We had a lot of stuff in our garage, man. It's gonna feel so good to have that space back. I might have to like get a workout machine. Just kidding, that's not gonna happen. just the beginning there's a whole another load to go do it is hot out here if you can't tell we're sweating working up a sweat but everyone's working so hard we got that done really quick now we're gonna go grab the other parts of the load the rest of the load come bring it back here and then we're done what was that are you kidding me I thought yeah. this was it. oh it's okay a little bit of hard work never killed anybody huh At least I don't have to work. yeah you watched <laughs> Daisy for us I think you get to watch Daisy for us when we come back yes yeah, nice not ideal timing for there to be rain and a good rain too you can hear it we did the second load and loaded it up and it started to rain and then there's a little bit of a clearing we thought the rain's done so we drove over here to the unit and it's pouring down so what i did i mean it's not as hot exactly katie i backed the trailer right up here and only logan and katie are with us because daisy's um daisy's napping right now and caleb's just keeping watch listening for her to wake up from her nap and we're i mean we're five minutes from home so we just brought this stuff over here with katie and logan so we're gonna unload it and then try and get out of here relatively dry well we're back home and it's about to rain and i'm not i'm not hating that gotta be honest we're all sweaty and disgusting and we're just happy that it's raining actually you gotta get in daisy come on in Hi. come on she just wants to hang out in the rain. We love you, Zoo family. Thanks for hanging out. We hope you enjoyed the beetle as much as you do. We're going to be having a lot of fun on that thing. We'll see you soon.